refuse to fuck with the media, but I had to tap in with my people, man, refuse media, that interview coming soon, they just lined me up for the free throw, you hear me? Yeah, do be on the lookout, oh. Top Shelf, quick, what up, what up, what up, what's cracking with y'all, man, for those that don't know, I'm the boy Top Shelf, y'all, welcome to Refuse Media, man. Yeah, man, y'all seen it in the title, y'all know what time it is, story time. And yeah, man, some bullshit. I got arrested for nothing, nigga. Who did it? Inglewood PD. Weird ass punk ass officer Cox. Big ass, big ass, bald ass, black ass nigga, ugly as on outdoors, ugly ass nigga, too, ugly ass. And this thing was black as hell, y'all. Everything was black. The white in his eyeballs was black, nigga. Black ass gums, black ass eyelids. Nigga, this thing was black under his fingernails, nigga. Big ass, ugly ass nigga. But look. Story goes, nigga. So, the, oh, this wasn't nothing recent either, nigga. This was way back in the day, nigga. What, like, 09. I was in barber college, nigga. So this was like, 09, some shit like that. Nigga. I leave barber college, mind you. I'm supposed to go, I gotta meet up, me and T. Lee, Barber and Beauty College, we gotta meet up with her pops, my father-in-law, to go pick up one of my daughters. Cause my oldest, I think, was, my oldest was like in kindergarten or something like that, the one right behind her wasn't in school yet. So, boom, we go pick up one. We go to go to my house to meet up. Mind you, I live in Inglewood at this point. I live in the bottoms. Uh, Crenshaw Mafia. I live in the bottoms at this point. On 104th and like Darby, some shit like that. I think the name of the street was Darby. It was right by Morningside High. Boom, we pull up. Mind you, we coming from Yukon. So the street called Yukon, we pull up to the light. We see it's like a little parade or something that Morningside High having. They having like a little parade or something for the high school. I pull up, I'm like, hey, I gotta, you know what I'm saying? I gotta go up in there. I gotta meet, you know what I'm saying? Pops get my daughter, he like, Big headed ass nigga, like, oh, can't nobody come in here at this time. I'm like, all right, all right, cool. Um, you know when it's gonna be, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to reason with the nigga, like, you know when it's gonna be open, so I could, I'm, I, I live here. I gotta get home. Stupid. With me having to get home, I'm like, nigga, that's my residence, nigga. I gotta, you know what I'm saying? Know what's going on. So, he like, nah, nigga. He ain't saying nigga. He's like, nah. Keep straight. I'm like, man, it's a parade going on. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he like, keep straight. I'm like, all right, bro, bet. He, he yelling him going, no, keep straight, keep straight. I'm like, bro, it's a red light. He look up. Oh, frozen in the motherfucking daylights. He get to talking shit, whatever, boo bop. I get to talking shit. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Boom, the light turned green. I peel off on the light, like, whatever, like, mm. boom, peel off on the light, this nigga reached for his blammer, I'm like, you seen that, that nigga reached for his blammer, like, what this nigga on the extras for, I'm like, boom, I keep on going, boom, this nigga jump in the car and turn on the lights, I'm like, hell no, nah. I'm mastering them up in the gas, like, nigga, you tripping, bro. Everybody knows, okay, so boom, I'm going in the Yukon. It's like Costco and all that shit right there, some restaurants and shit. So boom, I pull into the little parking lot, like, in hopes that it's going to be a gang of people or whatever. And it's like a little chicken joint to the left. So boom, I pull into the parking lot. Boom, swing to the left. I'm in like the little chicken joint. At this point, this si I can hear sirens going all around the motherfucking city. All, whatever street that is, Century or whatever, I hear sirens everywhere. Boom, the nigga catch up. Cherry me, whatever. Blueberry and cherry me, whatever. Woo, woo, woo. Niggas get out with their guns drawn, bro. Mind you, T and my daughter in the car. Niggas get out with their guns drawn the most shit. Get out the car. <laughs> Hands me on your head. Walk, walk towards my voice. All this extra shit, nigga. Mind you, for, for, for peeling off at the light. Whoa. Get me out. Search me. Woo, woo, woo. The nigga throw me in cuffs, put me in the car. I'm like, that's extra, bro. 
Boom. Throw 10 cups, put her in the car. Boom. I see them. Let her out the car. Let her out of cups. Boom, 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 whatever, whatever. All this talking going on. Boom. They come over talking about they taking me to jail. I'm like, nigga, for what? This the kicker. This nigga said, attempted assault and battery on a peace officer. I'm like, these niggas is tripping, bro. Attempted assault and battery on a peace officer. I'm like, how? He like, he said you tried to hit him with his with your car. I'm like, man, this nigga's a dickhead, man. This nigga's a weirdo, man. Ain't nobody try to hit Shrek with no car, man. But whatever, whatever, whatever. End up taking me to jail. When they taking me through the little intake for the little holding or whatever. I could obviously, the niggas who finna take my information and all that, I could see that they don't like this nigga. So it was like, it was a, it was a dude in the back and a girl. I don't know if they was playing good cop, bad cop with this nigga or whatever. Like, he's an asshole, but they cool. But you know how they do. And, uh, so they didn't like this nigga. Woo -woo. So, uh, boom. They, you know, you know, all that other shit. Height, all that woo-woo. They telling me turn around, woo-woo, all that other shit. Um. The lady, she like, she see my little barber college uniform and all that. She like, wait, you in school? I'm like, yeah, I'm in school and I work. She like, damn, how you getting in some trouble like this? I'm like, this nigga. They start laughing. You know what I'm saying? So he asking me like, all right, so what's the charge? He like attempted assault and battery. Bro, I kid y'all not. He dropped his pen like and looked at him like attempted assault and battery, which I took to offense, man, my nigga, because I don't do attempts, nigga. I get the job done, my nigga. So, I really wasn't feeling attempted assault and bat battery anyway, nigga. I'm going to assault you. But, uh, he dropped his pen like, all right, bro. He, take, he was like, so what was his weapon? The nigga say his car. Nigga damn near dropped his pen again and looked at old girl. She looked, she just shaking her head like, as if he always do this. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I forgot to tell y'all. Hold on. Before he took me in there, he take me out the car. He searched me again. Nigga, it's like, oh, nah, y'all had like 12 or 13 like dime bags of cushion in my pocket, my nigga. Uh, he like, oh, what are we going to do with this? I'm like, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I don't know. What is we going to do with it? He threw it in the dumpster. I ain't even gonna lie, man. The nigga seen he had the bags. He threw it in the dumpster. Boom, 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 boom. So mind you, boom, they take me in, boom, put me, you know, I'm in a cell, whatever. Woo, woo, woo. I'm, I'm obviously gonna bail out and all that, right? Here's the kicker where the nigga fucked up. Nobody read me my motherfucking rights. So when I bailed out, got lawyered up, they heard the story. Woo, 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 woo. Seen his report. Heard what I was saying? The nigga was like, bro, you, niggas was like, bro, you honestly have a case on your hands because them niggas ain't arrest you. Them niggas kidnap you. They can't just cuff you, throw you up in the car, and then take you to the motherfucking station. With, you know what I'm saying? You got to, you under the, you, you know what I'm saying? They got to read you your rights and all that other shit, which they never did. Big Head never did that. Ugly Man never did that. So... I got arrested for motherfucking nothing. Nothing at all. They was trying to charge me up on the extra shit. Boom, boom, boom. Lawyered up. Walked up out of there scotch-free with nothing. No time, no nothing. And nigga, I'm just like, bruh. Nigga tried to rap a young black man just on his ego. On his weirdo shit, nigga. And, oh, and it used to be a spot right there called Munchies. Like a little spot to eat and shit. They had a little parking lot in the back. I'm in the parking lot. I, can, I just got something from them. I'm in the parking lot. I'm waiting or whatever. I'm chilling. I look. Wow, I look over. This nigga was like three car lengths away from me, just sitting in the car. I'm looking and I'm like, boy, you wouldn't even know where it came from. Woo, he was just sitting there. But on, I start the car. I got up out of there and fuck this nigga. You know what I'm saying? Had to check. Hold up. Yeah, man. That was it right there. That was the motherfucking time your boy got arrested for motherfucking nothing. Or they say attempted assault and battery. But nigga, arrested for nothing. Arrested for trying to get home and they got a parade running down your motherfucking block. So you just trying to ask when can you go home and the nigga being an asshole. 
stupid ass. That's why y'all niggas was under investigation, because y'all was probably bumping them niggas, fucking with niggas for no goddamn reason. I feel for them niggas in Eaglewood. God damn. I'm up out of here, man. Top Chef Jacques, Top Chef Click. I owe y'all this, man. I love y'all. I love y'all for fucking with me. I love y'all for sticking with me. Fucking with me through all the bullshit. I owe y'all this story time. I owe y'all more. Are we dropping heat from now on? What reactions y'all want? What kind of videos y'all want? We finna do some shit. Love y'all. Top Chef Click. We up out of here.